uh, hello friends today in this tutorial I will be showing you a web application which will upload a image file to the Google Drive application so this is a demo application that we will be building in this tutorial using Google Apps script so here there is a choose file button if I click this button I will be redirected to select a PNG file so let me just select this file and click on OK and now in the background you will see that this will upload this file onto Google Drive so now the process is complete and let me just show you this you can see that this PNG file has been successfully uploaded you, you will see that this is there inside the images folder so in this tutorial we will be looking at how to automate this process of uploading an image file to your Google Drive using Google Apps Script so first of all you just need to go to a link which is uh, script.google.com so on this link we will be making a simple project here let me just move to a different Google account here so in this Google account there are no projects you can see that so if you haven't created any projects you will be seeing this screen here so just cl click on new project and then it will be redirecting you to the script editor so here we will be writing our all our google app script code here so this is a code.js file you can see that and now inside this file we just need to delete all this code here and we need to write a very simple function which will display a this form here to us that is choose file button form so for this we just need to write a very simple function let me just zoom in which will be do get So inside this function we will be loading a simple form here so for this we just need to write a very simple line we just need to write return HTML service dot create HTML output so you will see that this is a method that we will be using create HTML output from file so we will be giving a file name to it which will be form.html so we will create this file inside this so just click on file and create new an html file and we just need to name it as form.html and press ok so this is a form.html file and here we just need to have a simple form tag so just close the form tag inside this we will be having a simple input field input type will be file and uh, we will also be giving a name attribute to it of image file so just close it and after that we will be having a simple button to submit the form so input type button and the value will be equal to ok or you can just change this to upload and when we click this button we just need to execute a very simple function which will be google.script.run.upload so basically the name of the function is upload here you will see that and here we just need to pass a very simple argument in this this dot parent node and just close the parentheses and close the bracket so this is all the index.html code here form.html now we just need to write this upload function in our Google script so just write a simple function upload and this will receive the event so pass the e event and inside this we will be writing the logic to upload the file to Google Drive and the first step in order to do that we just need to declare a destination ID folder so basically this will be the actual ID of the folder that we need to upload the files to so first of all I have opened my Google Drive here I will create a new folder here click on new folder and name it as let's suppose images and create this folder so it is just creating it so after creating this folder brand new folder right click on it and in order to get the ID just click on get shareable link so after you click it so it is link sharing is off so let me just on it here so now you will get this link here copy this link and open it inside your browser 
and after the id is equal to this is actual id so just copy this id here copy it and paste it inside your folder id variable so you just need to repeat this process to get the destination id of the folder in this manner after getting the destination id we will be getting the image which has been selected by the user by e dot image file so basically we are using the name attribute that we have given inside form.html image file the same name attribute after getting the image we also need to set the content type to in this case i am just uploading the png image so image slash png so if you are in, in, uh, uploading jpg you, you will write here jpeg and after getting the content type we just need to declare again a destination variable and inside this we will use the drive app cl class and there inside this there is a method get folder by id and we will pass the id which we have stored inside destination id variable so bas basically this will get the folder which we have created inside of a google drive images by its id that we have passed here so now after getting the folder it is very easy we just need to upload the image file that the user has selected in order to do that we will be declaring this uh, variable image and again and then we will be getting the content type image dot get as and inside this we will be passing the content type to it variable which will be image slash png and now we just need to create this file so destination dot create file and we just need to pass our destination that we have created or image file that we have created so just the image file that we need to pass so now this code is complete and now we just need to run this file so in order to run this we will not be pressing this run button instead we will be first of all be publishing this uh, saving our file code so it is just uh, saving this file code so just wait now we just need to press the run button again here just pre press the run button so it is running this uh, we just need to grant the authorization permissions here so this will be only be done for the first time so i will be selecting a use another account here which will be this account click on next and the password will be auto filled so here we just need to go to advanced here and grant the permission go to un untitled project unsafe and grant this permission click on allow so now after this we just need to select this function which we have created do get and after that we just need to publish this app so go to publish here and select this option as deploy as web app and after that you just need to give your project version let's suppose i give it as first and this needs to be as default options you don't need to modify these and click on the deploy and now it will give you a link here it again just uh, asking for the permission so again grant the permission so this needs to be done for the first time now guys if you click the deploy button it will give you this uh, web app url so if you copy this url and uh, open this inside your browser so basically it will open this app here which will contain a simple upload file button and uh, here we just need to inspect element and go to console and click on choose file button so now if i click this button i will be redirected to select any png file let me select this file and click on ok so you will see that it will upload this file onto my google drive if i refresh it you will see that this file has been successfully uploaded to my google drive using google app script that we have built in this application 
and in order to make any sort of changes let's suppose i want to allow the jpeg files i can just make a change here jpeg and now in order to submit these changes first of all save this file and now again go to publish deploy as web app and now you just need to change the project version to 5 let's suppose update this and also click this update option so basically this will update the existing app and now if you open this app again you can just refresh it and again choose file button and now this time I will upload this jpg file and click on ok you will see that this will upload this file in the background and again I go to my you will see that this is a jpg file that we have uploaded here onto my google drive so in this example guys we have seen a very simple example on how you will make a very simple file upload application where you up upload your files to google drive without having to interact with the api just using simple google app script in javascript so thanks very much for watching this video